Look at how much change can happen in three months. So here's my skin right now. I took the beauty filter off so you can see. This was four months, but look at my skin versus now. I thought that my life was over and I thought it was never gonna get better. If I can post that online for millions of people to see, then you can leave your house, you can go to class, you can go to the grocery store, you're fine. I'm on month four of Accutane and I frequently post updates, but when I was in that state, I was so anxious to get out of it because I thought I was never going to. Just chill, you're fine, you are okay. Acne is normal, okay? So this is just a reminder that it's not the end of the world and it's gonna be okay. Love you all. Acne can lead to a lot of distress. Here are some things that you can do to help. Avoid overcleaning the skin. Avoid oil-based, comedogenic skincare, makeup, and sunscreens because these products can make your acne worse and always remember to remove makeup at the end of the day. Don't pick at or scratch your skin lesions because this can lead to an increased risk of scarring. And make sure that you use a non-alkaline synthetic detergent cleansing product twice a day. Fortunately, our treatments for acne have gotten better and doctors can prescribe gels and tablets to help treat acne and they usually take up to two months to be effective. But remember that they can irritate the skin, particularly at the start of treatment. If you are treated with Accutane or Isotretinoin, then please, please, please make sure you use sunscreen during the day. Make sure you do not donate blood during treatment or for several months after. And if you're female, please do not get pregnant during treatment or just after treatment because it can cause harm to your unborn baby.